Okay, I am back. As I was saying, it has 16 buckets. Each block, so this would be 160 buckets. And let's get down from here. Oh, sp splat. Oh, and here is... I really suck at trying to stand on oil. So it is currently pumping out this oily liquid. It should be doing it faster though. And I have a steady flow of energy right now. Maybe if I just switched it all to golden pipes. Golden pipes, I believe, do make it go faster than any other pipe for really anything. And when transporting liquids, it makes the. It makes it hold more liquid. And whenever transporting goods, it can be powered by redstone to make the goods skyrocket forward. Steam engines are powered by coal. Uh, redstone engines are powered by just redstone. And... Combustion engines, the last type of engine, are powered by fuel, but they are in constant need of water to keep running. And I could use with it being daytime. Now it'd be really fun if I moved this with the airship control. I'd just have to disconnect it here. But what my concern is, will the oil move? The oil in these tanks. I'm not worried about the oil if it moves from down here. So yes, this is actually pretty amazing, this machine. As those steam as those steam engines go, it produces energy that comes out here and just goes through the piping right into there. Now, I could e add even more. I put a redstone torch there. Oh, wonderful rain. Why did I put down a waterproof pipe? I don't need a waterproof pipe. There. And there. And just add coal instead of just adding water. Which will also make the energy just go. So yes, this really is amazing how the energy gets transported to this machine, and our oil supply isn't too large. Um, no. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I didn't have fly on. That could have been disastrous. It's gonna take a while for this to all extend because it has to verify that it needs to go down more to get more oil. And after this, I may just end up pumping out water, which wouldn't be too well. Because, you know, I don't want water. Wait. 
I think I'm having a problem. I think it's actually going through um, and hitting another pipe. Huh. I guess not. Ooh. What does this do? Uh. Huh. What? You can make something else out of this? Oh, it, it just tells you how to make it. Uh. Yeah. Whoa. I uh, don't exactly know what that is. Uh. Don't know what that is. I know what that is. I do not know how to get the fuel out of that. That makes oil and the fuel that. Stone cat hood. Stone pointer. And that's it. And I bet there's a lot of recipes for cobblestone. 83 crafting recipes. Huh. Well, I'll be. You can make dirt in a cobblestone. And you can make cobblestone, glowstone, and soul sand clearly. Because that makes perfect sense. Four sandstone equals a stone. And this much makes is it goes into a redstone uh, ore. Red it goes in a redstone ore. And all of this redstone ore goes in a two iron ore, which is somehow rarer. But if you just keep going through it, it'll give you iron ore, then diamond ore, which is just precious diamonds. You know, precious, precious diamonds. Who doesn't like diamonds? Diamonds are wonderful. I, I might actually make a diamond fountain. with the Technic Pack. I believe you can do that. Ah, it's finally getting down into the... Oh no! Why is that sheep not black? The sheep, why are you still white? You you defy physics. You've just been, you've been swimming in oil and you're a sheep and you're not black. Come on. Come on, man. just die. So this is basically anti-matter pickaxe. So yeah, that's kind of cool. Uh, fly speed 3. Well, I think that sums it up for today. I will be back with more Technic Pack for Technic Pack episode 3. And, uh, bye!